Um, this is kind of exciting. This is going to be my first of hopefully many, many haul videos. I am completely addicted to shopping and thrifting, thrifting mostly, and realized up until this, po up until this point that I should be filming these because I'm always watching haul videos and I just have never took the time to film one. So this is going to be my first of hopefully many thrift haul and just regular old haul videos. So I went thrifting today and pretty much all the things I'm going to show you today are clothing and I do sell on eBay. So I'll let you know which ones are for sale and then I'll leave the link to my eBay in the description box. So first bag is from just a regular uh, local um, rescue mission store. And on Mondays, they have dollar racks. And let me just tell you, I love a dollar rack. That's probably the best place, especially to find deals for when you're going to flip it on eBay. So I got this top for a dollar. It is a, kind of a blue green aqua y colored um, Worthington brand top. It's large. Um, I really like the the colors on it. I'm really into like the mint green and turquoise colors right now so that if it doesn't sell, I could probably keep it and wear it. Sorry if the lighting is so weird. Um, the, I li live in the basement. Bedroom light's not very bright and it's kind of cloudy out today so I just have my desk lamp. Um, this piece I'm going to keep for myself but I'll show you what it is. It's just a George brand black stretchy basic t-shirt. I probably have these George t-shirts that I've gotten at thrift stores in like five different colors because they're so soft and so comfy and I really like them. Then I got this one which I think I'll also keep for myself. Um, I think it was this one was a dollar. The, the George one was two dollars and it's Roxy which is great because I go buy Roxy Cupcakes, so it's perfect for me. And it's just a little polka dotted crop top. Pretty adorable. Then I got this one, which I think I'm going to sell on eBay. Um, and it is a Simply Vera, Vera Wang top. It's got embellishment on the side. And this one was also a dollar. And it's got the cool, let's see if I can do this with the lighting to make it work. It's got the mesh detail along the top. I have absolutely no idea if you can even see that or hear me, but we'll make it work. So that all costs like five bucks. Then I went to Goodwill. Well, I went to Goodwill first, but my bags were out of order. Um, Goodwill has half off tags on Monday, so I tried to make sure everything I got today was half off, um, but I had to get these shoes. When I saw these, they were just super cute. They are Sam and Libby, which is at Target. Um, they're floral and they're kind of that watercolor pastel floral. Um, and they are so comfortable. Like, they were super comfy. So, I brought, I, 5.55, but I had to buy them. Then I got this jacket, which I think I'm going to keep for myself, because it does fit, and I love this designer. It's Cynthia Rowley. And it's just kind of a purple bolero, that's sort of the style, um, blazer. And it doesn't have any closure, which is why I was a little iffy, but I think I'll wear it. I think it's pretty. And it's not like that blazery type material. It's more of a stretchy, like, cotton. Then I got this one, which, oh, the jacket I think was $3. Then this shirt I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sell on eBay. It's J. Jill, which I've heard from other thrift, fl thrift flippers on Instagram is a really good brand to look out for. And it's very nice. 
corally and I like I thought the color was really good for summer. And this I think I paid I hate this lighting, but we'll we'll get it figured out by the next video. It was only I think it was only two dollars because it was half off. Then I got this one, which I had never heard of the brand, but I carry my phone with me. Tip for anybody else who wants to thrift lift, keep your phone with you. And if you see a brand that you're not sure about, look it up on eBay and look for items that were recently sold and try to find ones that are similar and then see if for you it's worth the investment to flip it. For me, I look for pieces that have sold for more generally $10 or more because then I feel like I'm going to it'll be worth my time of trying to list it. So this one was one that I'd never heard of and had to look up when I was looking at all these. And it is Colson Italy. Let's see if I can do that. There we go. Sort of. Um, and it's just a little orange tank top. And this only costs a dollar. So I figured this was a great flip item. And so, yeah, that one will go on eBay. Then I got this one, which is a J. Jill Pima Cotton tank top. And this will also get thrift flipped on eBay. And I believe this one only costs a dollar also. Tank tops are generally $2 at my Goodwill. So on half off day, it's a dollar. And I got this piece, which I'm also going to flip on eBay. And it is BCBG Max Osria. And it's kind of a silky brown bronze top with a little cap sleeve, which I think is really pretty. Um, and it looked like it was in really good condition. Like I didn't see a lot of shirts. You see all that little pilling from when people have washed it. And this looks pretty new and thought that one was really good. Then I got this one, which I don't know if this is like their brand or if this is uniforms for people who worked in the store, but I really didn't care because it was Burberry and it's a polo shirt, black polo. It's got the Burberry on here and I paid $1.50 for it. So I thought even if this was a uniform, even if this was a knockoff, it is Burberry. So I'm not sure. I think it's real. Um, I'm getting good at figuring out knockoffs on purses. Not so sure yet on knockoffs on clothing. So I will, I will figure that out. That one I might just have to keep for myself because it's pretty darn cool. Then the last piece I got was another brand that I had to look up. And I don't even know if I'm going to pronounce this right. It's Levand, Levand, L-A-V-A-N-D. And it is a, top, a kind of a jacket. Um, it's got one, I believe it has, yep, it's got little buttons in the front. And my favorite part was the back. The detailing on the back of this, which I hope you can see right now. Look at that. That is gorgeous detailing. Okay. That stuff I paid. Let me look. $18.64. But if you take off the $5.50 for the shoes, it's like $13 bucks for all that stuff, which is not too bad. So I hope you like this video. I hope that you get some tips on flipping on eBay or just enjoyed seeing what I got in the haul. Don't be too harsh. This is my first one. And I know, I know my lighting sucks. And I will get that fixed and figured out by the time I have another video. And thank you for watching. Subscribe. And I will try to put up at least one or two haul videos a week. Have a great evening. Bye. Bye-bye.